what's going on guys it's Matty big chest of the DWZ and we are doing a um, little bit of a live stream here uh, I'm gonna be talking about JK Dobbins and what he brings to the table for the Baltimore Ravens Mark Ingram's hurt so JK Dobbins is probably stepping in so we shall see what's going on with JK Dobbins this is the first play from scrimmage he lowers his head makes a nice play he's this is what we've seen with him and the Ravens so far. This is what he does well is he stays up through contact. He knows how to bounce the outside. He, even if there's not a hole there, he's going to get three yards. Gets his pants pulled down. All right. Right here, there's really nothing going on. He's going to follow probably 75 here and just hit this guy and try to run him over. Yeah. Smart move. Good bounce. Nice hit. He cuts here and he establishes his balance, but he just gets destroyed before he can establish his balance. That was a nice move to hit the hole. He's in pass protection. Doesn't have to do anything here. Dobbins has the ball here. You see there's four red, five red jerseys. One, two, three, four, five. One linebacker getting blocked already. He's probably going to get a first down. No, he gets stood up. That's disappointing to see. I like that play. This shows Dobbins hitting the hole, finding it. I mean, he bounces outside there, honestly. But, man, you can see him reading the line of scrimmage. Good contact balance there. Just throws it away. So let's talk about this play right here. See, there's one red jersey right here. He misses his assignment. He's supposed to fill this hole, it seems. This linebacker needs to crash down a little earlier on the run. He's reading play action though gets blocked. Dobbins gets a nice gain here. Not much going. It's a nice bounce to the outside and a little concept run. Outside zone concept. Dobbins gets pushed back and pass bro. A little stutter step, a little stop and go. He's not the most elusive guy, but he's a guy who will, he's not afraid to get hit. So he's going to get contact yards. And, you know, he's kind of reminiscent of Nick Chubb, Josh Jacobs type back. And that's what I like to see out of him. Um, he's, he's a good running back, like right here. There's some contact behind the line of scrimmage and he falls forward for a positive gain. Looks like they might have marked him out a little earlier. But he still stayed up and stayed for a positive gain there. Good pass, bro, from Dobbins. It's a complete running back. Nothing. Bad blocking right there. He was supposed to release on a screen, it seemed. Yeah, he's supposed to get a screen. They read that well. A little balloon action. Oh, that was nasty. You know, 
to be able to establish himself after that, and then he does another cut up field, that is athleticism. That is something you cannot teach. That is something I want to see more of from J.K. Dobbins. Um, I want to see him do the little chop the feet, make a move, make another move. I want to, I want to see him put consecutive moves together like this. That's something Antonio Gibson does really well. That was a little nice stutter. Good job finding that outside zone lane. Right through the left tackle and the left guard. Or was that the tight end? Yeah, through the tight end and the left tackle. A little outside zone. He's so good on outside zones. Dobbins is open. Ooh, man, Fields had Dobbins wide open here. If you look at this, he read this perfectly. He called for the ball, too. He was upset he didn't get it. Wide open for a touchdown. Fields, man, I don't know if I like Fields that much. Dobbins gets tripped up. He steps on someone's foot, it seems. Nice bounce outside. Stays up through contact. That's a good run. I like that he stayed with the contact there. Nebraska's defense is tired. Mm -hmm. They're not getting the same push they did in the first. Yeah, you can tell. They're gassed. That defense is really tired. Dobbins getting an extra yards there. They're not getting in the backfield like they were before. Dobbins with a nice little jump. Didn't do much but fall forward. Yeah, J.K. Dobbins isn't bad. I really like J.K. Dobbins. I think that he has a good... Uh, a good read of offenses. He's a he's a smart guy. Um, he's gonna come in, and he's gonna do uh, basically what Mark Ingram did, but better. And uh, I think that he has a real potential to be RB one. So watch out for J.K. Dobbins. He reminds me a little bit of uh, a little bit of Nick Chubb, a little bit of Josh Jacobs in there as well. More so Josh Jacobs than Nick Chubb. Um, really good at outside zone concepts. This man has a potential to break it every time he touches it. But you know. The breakaways, his breakaway speed is questionable. He gets tackled from behind a little too much on college tape for me. Um, I'd show NFL tape, but it's going to get copyright claimed. Um, I really enjoy watching J.K. Dobbins play at OSU. He was one of the best college backs that is at Ohio State since Zeke. Um, so, yeah. Buy J.K. Dobbins before you, it's too late because he's going to be the starter. And, I mean, you're going to have to pay a pretty price to get him, too. So, good luck. if you. But if you have him... Congratulations, you got a stud. He looks good. He looks really good. Good pass, bro. Good receiving back. Um, other than that, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, have a nice day.